Sadness to frustration, a Southern California family seeking justice after their daughter died when a drug dealer knowingly gave her a pill laced with fentanyl. Now they're taking their case to a judge. Eyewitness News reporter Leo Stallworth has more on the family's legal victory. We are no longer as a society going to tolerate drug dealers killing our children. The family of this once budding 20 year old college student with a bright future winning a major multi-million dollar civil judgment against the man providing her what she thought was Percocet, a prescription pain medication. Sadly, 20 year old Alexandra Capaluto didn't know that pill purchased from the man via social media was laced with the deadly opiate fentanyl. The 20 year old ingesting half the pill and was dead soon after. He will be a free man in the year 2030, but he will not be free financially. The victim's family winning a nearly $6 million civil judgment against Brandon McDowell, who pleaded guilty to distribution and the tragic 2019 death of Alexandra. McDowell currently in federal prison sentenced to nine years behind bars. We are going to make sure if this man ever owns any property, these attorney hairs have already, attorneys right here have already said, we will put a lien on that property. We will garnish his wages. This ruling is not just a, day, a legal victory. It's a resounding triumph for truth and justice, a powerful tribute to the memory of a young woman whose life was unjustly taken. All she does is order on Snapchat a pill that she thought would help her sleep, takes half the pill, and dies instantly in her bed. The family of this beautiful young lady says even with the civil victory, they still will never have closure because every time they look at this picture, it reminds them that she's not here. It is not natural to lose a child.